area I have failed this year, Lord, take me there and declare me winner. Take me there and declare me every area I have failed this year, both spiritual, financial, marital, every area I have failed this year, Lord. Take me back and declare me winner. Open your mouth and pray. Bogo biti moti kuna. Bogo biti moti kuna. Oluwa, dame pada sibe. Swami di ashiago. Mo kolati mo fo chat eni no adui. Jesus Christ, Oluwa wa. A louder amen. amen. A better amen. amen. What bad, Lord? Every smart dog that have robbed me this year. I don't want to know you. Maybe you want to repent or you know repent to locate him and restore me. Whatever he collected from me, restore. This prayer point is all within last month to this time. It's almost six times I'm giving you this prayer point. And uh, some people have been calling me giving testimony on this prayer point. That's why I'm giving it again. No matter how smart they are, that rob me. Locate there and get it all back to me. I'm not going out of this year with empty hands. I cannot go empty. Whatever they collected, return it to me with interest. Return with interest. Return with interest. Open your mouth and pray. Lord, whosoever robbed me, locate there. Whatever they collected, Lord, take it back to me. Restore me with interest. Jesus, O Lua, Wa, Three Powerful Amen. Amen, Amen, Amen. Jesus. This one is very, very, very important now. When you see that pastor, say, Ah, if you know this man of God 10 years ago, na fire. If he didn't pray like this, miracle would happen. Fire would fall. But now, not in day again. Ah, that brother before if you go in house in the morning they say they pray no way to na evening go finish but now tell him to pray he go hit you <laughs> ah that woman he can read bible on top water if he they enter bedroom he they carry bible but now he cannot open bible again hmm that sister, hmm, church in the morning, church in the evening. Today, ask him why he no come. He go say you want to judge me, don't judge me. What is the name of that sickness? Lukewarmness, and not only lukewarmness. Oh, passion is time. Itaranku. Passion my dear it has affected everybody your own may not be worse now if it's not treated it's going to be worse tomorrow everything that connect us to God is going slimmer and shorter it's a big virus let's pray against it we are going to call God Olorun e mi mi mo Olorun agbara kini mo pe Olorun e mi mi mo Olorun agbara o ti nre mi ran agbara wa Olorun e mi mi mo Olorun agbara o o ti nre mi ran agbara wa let me interpret you will call the name of Jesus Christ once oh god of holy spirit God of power, I'm getting tired, very tired. Lord, 
release thy power unto me. Before my shame will be exposed, release thy power. Before enemy will dictate and strike me, release thy fire. Before they will arrest me and take me away, release thy power. Before I will be captured, release thy power. Open your mouth and pray. Oh Lord of Holy Spirit, oh God of power. Before it be too late, oh Lord, release thy power. Release thy power. Release thy power. Rag barawa. Rag barawa. Rag barawa. Rag barawa. Ayer ayer wa barawa. Koto baju olu arag barawa. Ki ele ya tote olu arag barawa. Ki o koko to bori olu arag barawa. Dide ira wo wuro rag barawa. Ira wo wuro rag barawa. Kio tato de siome na agbarawa Ki won to korin isegun ran agbarawa Oluwa ran agbarawa I'm getting tired I'm losing passion they stop power they send power they send power into my heart into my life into my body into my disinstant return power they send power in Jesus Christ's mighty name we pray. Amen. A louder amen. amen. A better amen. amen. Please let's still pray. Oh. Hey. And do you know the worst part? Something happened. This, I know. Let me show you the difference. In the olden days, if we discover this sister is going weak, before we even go to her, seven days prayer has gone. We will go into prayer restlessly. We are fire, return, equip, return, empower, empower. In fact, that sister will be restless. He will not be able to sleep. What is happening? He will don't, if I don't enter prayer, finish, come up. Now say, do you know something happened to you last month? But I thank God you have restored. Yes, so to pray become difficult. I was worried. But I know some people are praying for me. Glory be to God. That's what we want to know. You are restored now. Yes. That is how we do it last time. In the olden days. But these days. <laughs> the problem is this. When I'm going weak. I will detect someone going down. Still thinking I'm better than that person. Are you getting it? When I'm going weak. I will be detecting someone going down. So by the time I now go to, you know, when the person that wants to correct you himself is going weak, instead of him to be your strength, he will be condemning you. Am I talking sense? In those days, we look up to those people that are better than us. But in this day, we detect those we are better than. That's a major problem. When you are a Christian, you always see that I'm still better than this. In their church, they use wig. They use earring. In our church, we no use. You are going down. See yourself as a solution to the people that are weaker than you. And see those people stronger than you as your help. Am I talking sense? Babe, the worst part of this situation is that when we now see people way better than us, say for us to submit to them for help, we still say, eh, he's jealous of me. Uh -huh. Don't judge me. How do you know you are better than me? How do you know you are greater than me? You know how many times God talked to me? Ability to submit, to receive help is no more there. We just want to be the all in all. We just want to know that we are better than others. And everyone better than us, we don't want to even agree. Everyone we are better than, we can't help them. We can't. And we will be able to help them. Oh. But to help something, someone, because it's a spiritual something, Abby, to help them, your heart must feel pity unto them, not angry. Did you get me? Yes. When your heart feels pity unto them, to help them will be faster. But my dear, they will force you to be angry with them. So that even though you pray for them, the prayer not go work. The statement you will hear from your mouth, no minor. They tell me, say, I'm backslide. 
In where they hear, where they tie scarf, where they do everything. You know they backbite. They will judge you the way that to even need that and pray for them. You yourself, before you start the prayer, you know God will not answer. So, devil make us too weak to help each other. And uh, there's something very easy in the church today. We are the great dictators of our brother. We dictate, ah, that pastor is not hot again. Ah, no, if you know that sister. Two years ago, if this sister carried a microphone leading praise and worship, you see people falling under anointing. Ah, when the people are falling under anointing, did you go into fasting and prayer for her? Now, nobody fall under anointing. Shame still no cast you. You still say it. Ah, that's too terrible. Too, too terrible. Let us pray now. Lord, make me strong enough to help others. Make me strong enough to help others. Agbara to to gbe eme ati awon araro agbara to to gbe eme ati awon araro oluwa gbe wo mi make me strong enough to help others i'm ashamed of my spiritual position make me strong make me strong open your mouth and pray <laughs> strong enough to help others make me strong enough to help others Jesus Christ, mighty name we pray. We are going to pray. God, every weapon of darkness in my hand that I am using to enjoy your church, damaging your church, scattering your church, Lord, open my understanding, take it away from me. Open your mouth and pray. from me deliver me deliver me in Jesus Christ mighty name we pray we are going to talk God God the attitude of me that always exposed me to danger Lord take it away the attitude of me the way I think the way I talk the way I act always expose me to danger lord take it away from me open your mouth and pray in jesus christ mighty name we pray lord every spiritual pillar you assign for me which have been demolished or fall or weak lord keep them standing again it may be somebody that God has assigned to be praying for your church, praying for you. Rumor and tongue has weakened their hearts. They can't do it with love again. My dear, no matter how strong is the Holy Spirit in you, and the Lord show you this brother must not die, and you now hear that this brother say, you are a liar, you are a fornicator. Continue praying. That thing in your heart will not allow the prayer to work. That's what they do. Anybody praying for church, praying for you, they make sure you he hears something about you that will make the weapon in his hand useless so that you can be captured. And if that person where they pray to have the attitude of the world in him, his attitude too will make you to say, 
she did not have Holy Spirit in a demon he have. She cannot have Holy Spirit and behave like this. Yes, now, when the person you are praying for said that to you, and you too, that you are praying for someone, condemn that person too. What I hear about you make me angry. What you hear about me make me angry, make you angry. You are praying for me, I'm praying for you. Who be the mumu we go answer the prayer? Am I talking sense? And they say, if heaven and earth pass away, the list of the word of God will never go unfulfilled. He said, if I eat the iniquity in me, and the iniquity has been installed by rumor or bad tongue, the iniquity is there and you are preparing for prayer. Don't go. That is the secret of the problem of all so-called holiness church. They know they cannot stop you. But they can set you against each other. That's the secret. But when you tell them, even though God can tell you it's a winch, don't talk like that. Keep on praying. Let God work. They will not listen. And they will be happy. Yes, we will use her to destroy what she's praying for. They won't listen. They will believe I am a fool telling them that. They don't know that they are the weapon of darkness. Even though you thought you see more than me, Still listening to me, oh. or else you fast and pray throughout your life. And when you get to heaven, they open your record. They say, Why you never even pray for this church one day? You say, Eh, hey, me, oh, bad, church. I pray for that church all my life. See your record out of 2,500 prayer, only one is recorded just because you refuse. To obey instruction, you thought you are right. And upon all your work, when God supposed to fight for you, He did not fight for you. That's a con they pay you. God, you say I should leave my family, I leave them. God, you say I should leave my marriage, I leave. God, you say I should leave. And see the way they attack me. God, why can't you fight for me? God never see you in the office for one day. No be the person where you employ, where you come office, you go fight for. I give you employment letter. I don't see you for office. How do I fight for you? Ah! If you die thinking you are suffering for God and you die, God say you no suffer for him. He will pain you. You better listen to instruction before it will be too late. You thought all your suffering is for God. Who sent you? My dear, check it out. Check it out something is missing god is not wicked god cannot send you and forsake you if there's no mistake something is missing you have lost too much you must not lose again Amen. check it you must be restored this time around Amen. all those tactics that devil is using in order to molest you that tactics fail today in the name of jesus you cannot die as a victim but as a victim so that shame that tie you down from your brain to your heart is broken today you are going to pray you are going to tell God God our ability to come out from the web of darkness Latino Apollo break shen in the break 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 open your mouth and pray In Jesus Christ, mighty name of prayer. Amen. That person you have chosen as my pillar. <laughs> Whatever injury in that person, Lord, remove, heal, and make him strong again. Excuse me. A house that has pillar, no matter how strong is the iron we put on this roof, that did not make him fall in the middle. If anything happened to the mid pillar by the side, 
The iron can it start? My pillar that keep me standing must not restore my pillar. Restore my pillar. Restore my pillar. Yeah. Oh Lord my God. My pillar must not fall. My pillar must not crack. My pillar must not wake. Restore my pillar. 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 Make my pillar strong. My pillar shall not fall. In Jesus Christ, mighty name we pray. The last one. There's wisdom for obedience. Wisdom means what should I obey? Which one is right? Which one is wrong? Wisdom for obedience. Another one is strength to obey. Ah. Ah. If I say I want to obey God, I will remain jobless. If I want to obey God, <laughs> to get husband will be difficult in this country. Oh, will I die childless? Our menstruation will soon stop. Strength to obey. That is where strength is needed. The last one is boldness. Boldness means when somebody you fear, respect so much, come to intimidate you to lie. We do respect, sir. I'm sorry to say, but truly, I did it. Forgive me, I did it. Ah, you did it. You did grace. Sorry, sir. Do you know that you have lost your job now? Sorry, sir. Do you know you have skinny cancer? Sir? Sorry, sir. <laughs> that is boldness. My dear, no power three Hebrew use that day. Boldness. Determination has been made. Fire threaten their determination. Boldness make it strong. Fire threaten, but boldness strengthen. Fire threat the, their determination. Boldness strength it. So you will ask, what is the first thing you will ask? Wisdom for obedience. Strength for obedience. Boldness for obedience. Lord, give me this three power to obey you to the end. The wisdom, the strength, the boldness to obey. Open your mouth and pray. Hey, Mimi Give me boldness and strength to obey you to the end. Wisdom of obedience, give unto me. Wisdom of obedience, give unto me. Wisdom of obedience, Lord, give unto me. Give unto me, O Lord. Give unto me, O Lord. Give unto me, O Lord. In Jesus Christ's mighty name, we'll pray. Today's message shall not condemn us. He shall help us. He will strengthen us. He will strengthen us. He will bless our soul. He will make us stronger, wiser, and bold. At the end, this message of today, we shall jubilate at the end. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus Christ's mighty name, we'll pray.